Josh is going to be a bit late. Uh, he's in a meeting. So Dave will probably be here before Josh. Uh, when's the next uh, look Raw tonight? I might book Raw while I'm waiting for these two. Right, let's have a look at my storylines while I'm waiting for the other two. Uh, okay, so let's start with that. The six man. Three versus three. And we'll do pick up. Oh. Kaleo, uh, Alpha, Samu versus. Hmm, who do we have? <coughs> uh, Ray Mysterio, maybe? Otis, there we go. Good choice. Otis, we'll have Otis in this. Um, Razor. Right, let me just check the chat. No, nope, nobody in. No. Battle of the big guys here. Uh, I'm going to do slow build for that one because I think. I think that needs it. Uh, we'll do an angle with Paul Heyman, microphone, and then we'll just do Otis, microphone, uh, Akum, Razor, uh, and then Afa, Samu, Piccolo. Right, so that's that done. All right, let me just check the chat. No, hello, anybody in there? Feel free to say hello. Baxter, say hello. Baxter, laziest dog ever. Uh, I feel like a lion holding up the lion. Lion King. Yeah, Baxter. Come on then, baby boy. All right, you come here. You sit there, and you'll go to sleep there. Good boy. I washed this bloody mask for the first time uh, ever and well I used to hand wash it so it has been washed I decided to wash it in the washing machine uh, and the tumble dryer and it's shrunk so it's a bit snug on me at the moment but I can't remember the jaw uh, but yeah right so let's get back to this so that's one storyline done Let's do another storyline. Let's do five way singles. Ronda. Zoe. Bailey. Alexa. And Sharp. More women's. Uh, open match, decisive win. So, oh yeah. Yep, that's fine. Ronda Rousey, microphone. Uh, Bailey. 
microphone, that's the bliss. Microphones, Zoe Stark, not rated, and then ooh, Charlotte. Microphone, there we go. So right, I need to no, I didn't mean to do that. I need to put that one down there. And that one down there. Hello. Hello, Dave. How are you? You all right? I thought I forgot to book Raw earlier, so oh. So when you left, we decided to um leave it for the for the night so you haven't missed anything. We didn't think it'd be fair on you. Because I was thinking originally I was thinking of just doing this show when you weren't online. Um but Josh pointed out that you might not want to miss what I end up doing, so uh we saved it. But we've been floating ideas about um what to do when it comes to TW stuff. What well, now? Restart it then. Don't worry. Um, Josh is running a bit late anyway. So, okay. Can you hear me though? Can you, can you hear me? Can you hear me? Can you hear me, Dave? Can you hear me, Right, let's have a look at me other storylines. Actually, no, I'm going to uh, do another match first. Uh, I'm going to do Jay Cargill. I'm going to give Jay Cargill a bit of a push now, I think. Get her up and running. Jay Cargill. So we'll go female. Exclude, already booked. So this match is going to be an absolute terrible match. There's no way of getting around this. Actually, I'm going to use this as a pre-show match. So we'll do... Yep. Uh, open match. Decisive win. Slow build. So the push for Jay Cargill begins. Right, Dave should be back in a minute. Josh will be here in a minute as well, so I can carry on doing all this. Uh, let's put Sami Zayn versus uh, who do we have Sami Zayn go against? For some reason, I think Robert Roode would be a good match for him. So that's that, and then we'll do an angle to do that. So do Sammy microphone, Ooh. Robert Rude microphone. So we'll have James Storm involved as well. Microphone, and we'll have Xbox microphone. All right, let's just check the chat. No one else, that's fine. Uh, we all okay still? Let me just keep this here. Yes, we are. I have backup mics today, just in case. So you might not hear me as well, but you'll still hear me. And I won't have to restart the bloody stream. Uh, yeah. Right. How much have we done now? 96, okay. Right, let's check the other storylines. Uh, Andrade versus Bobby Lashley. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. No, that's not what I wanted to do. That's what I wanted to do. So we go... 
four way singles. Do Andrade, Bobby Lashley, Happy Corbin, and let's see who else. Randy Orton, maybe. Logan Paul. Uh, and then we just do just the match, decisive win. Do that like that, and then we'll do an angle. Just need to do this, push that down there, like so. Dave's not back yet, Josh's not here, that's fine. Right, uh, I'll do a CM Punk promo now. Microphone, I'll put John Cena in there, microphone. Steve Austin, microphone. Let's see what else we can put in this. Just waste a bit of time. What do you do, Humberto? Microphone and go microphone. Yeah, we'll leave that as that. Oh, someone's in. All right, work waiting room to be added to a meeting which will last 15 minutes. So, anytime I disappear. Yeah, that's fine, Josh. Don't worry about it. It's okay. Dave's had to reset his computer anyway so uh he's got all the audio issues i'm just booking raw i haven't done anything other than that dave come in briefly um to let me know he's having audio issues and he said he's resetting his computer so he should be back in about five minutes i don't know um but yeah i'm just booking it basically john cena cm punk Humberto Angel. Oh, he's here. He's back. You can hear me. Excellent. Right then. I've gone over the two hours, so I'm not going to book anymore. I'm just going to leave us that, so I'm going to start the show. Uh, I did a pre-show with Jay Cargo. I'm going to start pushing her. So, um, yeah, so she beat BFAB. Only got a 50 rating, so but hopefully it won't affect, it, affect my show rating too much. Uh, I did an opening segment with Otis and AOP uh, arguing with the... Bloodline, uh, Samoan SWAT team with Paul Heyman there involved as well. Got a 90 rating. And then I did a six-man tag with the Bloodline, Samoan SWAT team versus Otis and AOP. And Otis and AOP defeated them uh, when Akam pinned Hikolo. Got an 84 rating. So uh, that's good. Did an angle with... Ronda Rousey, Bailey, Alexa Bliss, Zoe Stark and Charlotte Flair to set up their five-way match. And in the five-way five match, Ronda Rousey retained her title. That got an eight rating. Uh, I did a, an angle with Six-Pack arguing with Sami Zayn. Uh, Sami Zayn challenged Robert Roode to a match. Uh, the match got an 87 rating. Sami Zayn retained his title. I uh, did a four-way angle involving Lashley, Andrade, Corbin and Logan. Got an 87 rating. And then we had a four-way match, which Happy Corbin won. Got a 93 rating. <clears throat> and then I did uh, an angle with... I, I threw Stone Cold in there just to help the rating of the angle. But uh, basically, it, it's just an angle to set up a tag team match with CM Punk and John Cena versus Humberto and Angel. Uh, and then 
in the main event, which which this is hilarious, by the way. I left it. I left it to. Um, I left it to the auto booker, thinking they would just book John Cena and CM Punk to beat them. But somehow, Los the Fairy Rose have defeated John Cena and CM Punk. <laughs> and I got a ninety-one rating. That'll that'll teach me for not having it, not setting the right people to win. But oh well, they get a big rub, Humberto and and girl. Uh, got a ninety-one rating. You making note of that, Josh? Ninety-one rating. Right, are you two still in there? Have you have you just had to disappear? Uh Dave, at some point Josh has got to disappear for fifteen minutes for uh for a meeting. So hopefully Josh, if you just let us know when you've got to go um for that meeting and then I can just Cheers Dave. Thank you. Um so Dave, me and Josh have been talking offline what we're gonna do moving forward. So Doing three days of TW is not working for me, so we're going to do two days of TW. I'm going to do a build a nation save on Football Manager on the on the, the first day of every week. Uh, I haven't decided which nation yet. So, um, so what we're going to do Monday, we'll do the WWE stuff. So we'll carry on with that. So Monday, we'll just carry on with this, and then Tuesday, me and Josh were thinking, and maybe if you wanted to. Um, would you want to do, if we pick a, well, basically, uh, Josh will explain it better to me in a minute when he messages in the chat, but basically me and Josh have the idea of all three of us. So we'll have a free player game on this, even though I'm obviously going to be doing all of it, but we'll all pick a promotion each, uh, whether it's in the UK or America, and we'll pick like a low, what they call a local one. So the smallest one we can possibly find. Um, and then basically what we do is we then try and we'll have the same budgets, the same reputation. Um, and then we basically try and see how we get on about going from local to global. So, so like Tuesday, so Mondays will be WWE and then Tuesdays will be this battle of the promotions thing. Yeah, we got the impression that. Um, over the last, because the last couple of times you've been on here, you've had to leave early. So, what what would you like to do moving forward? Because me and Josh can just do a two player local to global thing, and you can just join in and you know in the chat and make suggestions. Yeah, is it is it is it getting a bit boring for you? Is it a bit too much? Yeah, I mean, would you prefer just to watch me and Josh do it? Or would you want to feel included? Because I don't want to start suddenly not including you if you're not enjoying it. We just want you to be enjoying it and not feel like it's a slog for you. Yeah. Do you still, what, do you, what would you like to do moving forward then? I appreciate that. Thank you. No, I appreciate it. And we love having you here because you, you are a, a great contribution to to uh to the to the there to the stream so you know you and Josh have been my loyal uh, loyal followers so I'll always appreciate you but like I said I don't want you to be bored or not bored but I don't want you to feel like it's a bit of a cuz I get like that with TW sometimes it is a, it feels like a bit of a slog so I understand so what do you want to do moving forward would you like to carry on um uh, would you want to still do the WWE stuff um yeah is that would you just prefer to take a back seat moving forward and just let me and josh do it because i don't want you know because you can always come back if you want can't you you can always come back if you if you want to get into it we can always if we do do the uh local to global thing and you decide in a couple of weeks time that you want to get involved we can always add you as a promotion can't we i think i think you can add, add a player afterwards Okay, so moving forward, do you want so starting today, should we basically what we can do is we can get rid of Dynasty. Um Yeah, no, I don't apologize, Dave. At the end of the day, if it's if it's too much commitment or too much of a like a you know, like a slog at times, 
It's fine. Josh pointed this out to me and I never even realised that you were. I just assumed you were just busy and you had to go. So, yeah, what we'll do then is if we get rid of the Dynasty brand, or do you want to book one more? Let's see what the next show is. So you got your, do you want to do your last show, Dynasty now, or do you, do you want to play it today with you managing Dynasty, and then next week what we'll do is we'll we'll spend an episode basically we'll we'll do the brand split again we'll just we'll get rid of everybody on the rosters and we'll start the brand the brand split again yeah no it's all right mate it's all right because i i struggle to remember who i've got on my roster half the time if that's the only issue if you think that you're letting us down don't think that at all if you if it's a confidence issue with you then don't worry about it because you know, at the end of the day, we, we're patient with you. You don't need to feel like you need to rush. If it's generally just like too much for you, then that's fine as well. No, we'll we'll carry on with WWE, Josh. What I'm going to do is, if it's all right with Dave, if he wants to book one more episode of Dynasty, and then what we'll do after he's done that, we'll we'll basically. We'll re redo the brand's brand split, but what I would like to do, Josh, if it's all right with you, is we'll get them to do it automatically instead of us picking one after the other. I think that would make it more interesting because we won't know who we've got, and then we we can't do nothing about it, and then we'll have to just go because I think it would split it up. Yeah, all the workers, other than obviously, yeah, all the workers, yeah. Or is that is that going to be? Yeah, but it might be funny though. But it might be entertaining, wouldn't it? I think if we if we basically if we decide that we do it ourselves, just you and me, we're basically going to try and pick the same same people because we know what we're looking for, don't we? I think it would make an interesting twist, and I also think it would make us better as bookers to book what we've got. If you generally don't want to do that, that's fine. I just think us picking who we want to pick. I think that's a bit boring in my my opinion. Um, but it's up to you. Dave, what do you think we should do? Because you're gonna you're gonna have to you're gonna be our booking consultant now. <laughs> you're Vince McMahon and me and, and me and uh, Joshua Paul Heyman and Eric Bischoff. Dave gone. Dave, you still there, mate? Oh, there he is. It's all right. We could just do it. I'll tell you what. What we could do, we could do it for a laugh, see what happens, and then if it, it, if it all goes pear-shaped, what we can do is just end it again, and then we'll just do it properly. It's worth... It's, it's entertainment at the end of the day, and it? It, might, it might make people laugh on here. Dave, do you want to book one more Dynasty show or not? Oh, God, we've got to keep Dynasty now, haven't we? Because um, we can't just cancel the contract because it will cost us money. Yeah, this stream, Josh, yeah. Unless Dave, want, unless, unless Dave wants to do one last stream, booking Dynasty, and then we start it on Monday... Hello, Ifanga, 80. Nice to meet you. I'm all good, mate. How are you? Uh, feel free to give me a follow, please, Ifanga. I'm one, I'm one follower away from being um, possibly monetized. So I would appreciate you giving me a follow if you don't mind, but only if you want to. Uh, I worry if we do that, Josh, we might alienate some people who actually come on to watch TW stuff because some people actually like to watch WWE being booked. I think if we uh, if we bin off, Ifanga, if you if you're a reg if you're a regular coming up, you can you can help us book. <laughs> we can't book Dynasty, bin it off. What do you mean we can't book Dynasty? We could add Dynasty as a. We could do half and half on Dynasty, couldn't we? There is ways around it. Can I get rid of it? Should I just delete it? Dynasty. 
Uh, modify. Dormant. Let's see if we can make this dormant. No, we can't make it dormant. Right. Any suggestions, Josh? <laughs> Bin it off. Hey, Fanga, it's supposed to be on my side. <laughs> But we put so much effort into this WWE save, I don't want to bin it off just yet. I wanted to do at least 12 months of booking on it. I've put we've put a lot of hours into this. I don't mind Dave not wanting to do it because he, you know, he doesn't want to do it. I'm not going to force him, but I don't want us to just get rid of it. Oh, okay. Okay, how do I do that then? Right, broadcasting, isn't it? Dynasty. There you go. Negotiate. Cancel. There we go. Oh, it only cost us eight million. We've cancelled it. We're sorted. Right. Uh, events. Modify. Dormant. It's not on the air. Why won't you let me make it dormant? I took it off the air. Hold on. Have I missed something here? Broadcasting. Oh, no, let me check the chat. Maybe you're shouting something at me. Yeah, you owe us eight point. You know, you owe us eight million. Where are you from, then, Ifanga? Are you UK based or are you um, uh, 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 not UK based? Ah, that's why it won't let us because we've got to cancel this one as well. Right. Hopefully, I can bin it off now. Oh, it's off. It's off automatically. It's fine. Right, we need to we need to cancel that. I need to basically remove all the dynasty ones. Dynasty remove. Dynasty remove. All right, let me check the chat. I don't want to be ignorant. Ah, first Aussie, welcome. Where are your family from in England then? All right, we'll just we'll just draft Dave's wrestlers then. Fine. Uh, right, WrestleMania Night Three. We'll move that. Don't worry, I am I am paying attention. I'm just trying to delete all of these events quickly. Dave, your booking will be missed though. We will miss you booking, but we I, I totally understand what it's like when a game gets too much for you, but I'll have many fond memories of, you, of us booking against each other. And you're always welcome to come along and book again if you want another crack at it. Right, is that all the Dynasty pay-per-views? I think that's all the the dice. Can you see what I can see? Yeah, you can. That's all right. Then. Right. Um. Right. Let me just check the chat first before we do anything else. North London. I'm from the. Uh, I'm from near Birmingham. Um, Zone Mister FM, who is my friend Josh. He is from Brighton, and the Wrestling Guy ninety seven, who is Dave. He is uh, from London, I think. What we could, what I want to do is tie the WWE save up today at the very least. Just finish it off because we've already done like half an hour. Um, I want to set, if I'm going to do it, I want to set it up offline, my part of it. Because if, it, if we do, if we do the local to um, the other one, me and Josh, Josh can communicate with me offline, tell me what he wants me to do over the weekend when I'm free, and I can set it up, and then we'll have everything set up hopefully. Uh, or nearly set up on Monday. And if we do start Monday, or we could do the local to Global One Monday, maybe do the WWE one, or we can switch between the two depending on what we fancy doing on the day. It, we can just make it a little bit more, you know, not so rigid or not so planned 
We just go with what we feel like on the day. But we can do the local to global one. I don't mind starting it because I'm looking forward to doing it as well. But I just feel like we put a lot of effort into this WWE one and I don't really want to just bin it off. And I'm also worried that if we just do the local to global one every day, it's not going to get many people watching because it's the same on Football Manager. Like if you you get if you if you manage a big team, you will get a lot of casual fans that will gravitate towards that, especially like a big team like Man United, Arsenal, Liverpool, Man City, etc. So um, yeah, uh, we've been doing it for quite a few weeks now with Fango. I can't remember exactly how many how many weeks we've been doing it. If, if you're on about in real life, we've been doing it for. A, I think two or three weeks, and then but on the actual game, it's the actual game itself. We've done, I think we've done about three months worth of gameplay on it so far. I could be wrong. That's it. Yeah. So we've already done six months. Um. So yeah, we put a lot of effort into it. Who's your favorite wrestler, then, Fanga? Are you a big wrestling fan? I bet you love Rhea Ripley, don't you? Thank you, uh, thank you for following me uh, on here, Ifanga. Much appreciated. Yeah, I'll do the draft in a sec. I just there was something else I needed to do, and I can't remember. Oh yeah, sorry, Ifanga wants to look at the champs, didn't he? Right, let me just show you the champs, Ifanga, that we've got, and then so. Um, I've got CM Punk as my heavyweight champion. He recently beat Happy Corbin. I had Happy Corbin as the champion for a while because basically, for some reason on the game, Happy Corbin is an amazing worker and, and amazing on the mic. So I just went with it. Um, Dave had his own brand called Dynasty and his heavyweight champion was Kevin Owens. His tag team champions were New Day and I've got the European title, and Sami Zayn is my European champion. Um, Dave has got the Dave had the, the Inter Intercontinental Championship, and he had um, Apollo Cruz win it. The Money in the Bank for some reason it hasn't worked on here. I don't know why that hasn't worked. Uh, Josh, put in the chat who won the Money in the Bank, the men's and the women. I think the men's won. Oh yeah, the men's Money in the Bank because we just recently did the Money in the Bank pay per view. Uh, and the last stream and Okada won the men's one and I can't remember who won the women's one but it is it is on here somewhere there you go but for some reason it's not come up with who's the champion Josh will tell you though because he's the historian here we he's the one that does all the uh the the thinking for me because my memory's not the best uh I've got AOP as my raw tag team champions I've got Ronda Rousey as my women's champions Josh who's in charge of Smackdown has Tyler Pate Tyler Bate and Pete Dunne his tag team champion he has Shayna Baszler as his women champion. Chad Gable is his United States champion. Um, and he has Cody Rhodes as universal champion. And then Dave, who was in charge of the women's tag team uh, title division, he had the Kabuki Warriors as his tag team champions. Right, before I do anything else, I'm just going to check the chat so I haven't missed anything. Oh, right, okay. I don't think you're missing much in the space of 12 months, really. I mean, Co Cody Rhodes got screwed over at WrestleMania last year, but, you know. Um, right, back in 10. All right, then, Josh. So when Josh comes back, we will do the um, brand split. And basically, um, we'll we'll brand split the, the workers that Dave had on his Dynasty uh, promotion. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Well, let me just check that then. Money in the Bank. I don't know why we had... We had for some reason, we had Raw and SmackDown, but I don't know why. Money in the Bank, Okada won it. And then the women's one, Oscar won it for the second time. So she won it back to back. Which was quite funny because Oscar won it um, because basically what we did in both Money in the Bank matches, we had eight people in the match and... We had two wrestlers each from our brands and then there was a guy called JBRZ on here. I let him pick the other two wrestlers um, and Dave doesn't have a women's singles title on his brand. So it was quite funny that Oscar won it because 
she can't cash it in because <laughs> there isn't a women's singles ma title, so it was quite funny. But now she will be able to cash it in because there's no Dynasty brand, so wherever she ends up going will end up basically, she'll end up having the chance to cash it in if we decide to do it that way. Did you watch uh, Elimination Chamber then? Did you did you watch it? Because it was a big, big it, it did it was really successful in Australia, wasn't it? Rhea Ripley was like the hometown hero. Grayson Waller got a bit of a, a bit of a pop as well, didn't he? Uh, if you haven't watched it, give it a watch because it was a good pay per view as well. To be honest, the crowd was really wild, uh, really like into it as well, which was good because you always want a good crowd. You still with us as well, Dave? Right. If we retire that one, retire that one. Uh, edit belt. Brand, 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 brand. Then none. And then, right, in the column and all, edit that one as well. None. I need to retire that one. Retire. Retire. Right, let me check the chat. Oh, okay, fair enough. Yeah, give it a watch at some point. You, you probably will enjoy it. But there's um you know there's a lot of Australian wrestlers doing well in America at the moment whether it's WWE or AEW or uh, TNA and stuff like that so um Buddy Matthews is doing well in AEW in the House of Black faction if you don't know that already so um you got Dana Brooke is doing well in TNA you've got obviously Rhea Ripley and Grayson Waller in WWE Indy Hartwell as well so um there's some good talent coming from Australia. That is SmackDown, yeah. Right, Universal Women's, women's Tag Team. Right, okay. So that's that sorted. Yeah, thanks again, Ifanga, for following me. You now, I've now hit. Oh, here you go. Hello, Max, Maxi Matt, Maxi Max. I call you Maxi Matt then, didn't I? Max Hit Matt. I'm just gonna call you Max. Oh, do you know? Do you two know each other then? Hey up. I feel like there's gossip to be told here. Have we got to watch out for this, Ifanga, um, Max? Call him Hit. Okay. How long have you two known each other then? Too long. <laughs> now, how long have you two known each other then? How do you know each other? Is it through TW? Are you two fierce rivals, really?
through streaming. Oh, okay, cool. So you, t oh, hold on, let me give you a follow. I forgot to give you a follow, Ethanger. Sorry, mate. I always follow the people that follow me back, so I appreciate that. So I'm just giving you a follow. Uh, I think I've followed you, Matt, as well. Yeah, I've already followed you, Matt, so that's all right. Max, not Matt, sorry. Hit, hit, there we go. Um, that's good. Do you know what? That's how um, me and Josh know each other, um, who's called um, Sugar. I can't remember his name now. What's his bloody name? Zone Mr. FM. Zone Mr. FM on here. Um, we basically, Josh used to post diaries in the on the Grey Dog Software forums. And uh, I really enjoyed his New Japan uh, diary. So I messaged him because I was going to start my own diary. Um, there he is, talk of the devil. And basically, we I messaged him. We, we uh, swapped Facebooks. Um, and we've been mates for a, a, quite a few years now all started from our love of TOW. So it's quite nice to see that you two know each other for the same reasons. So yeah, Josh, they've, they've, uh, they knew, they know each other. Efanger and Max hit Matt know each other. So there you go. Call me Matt, mate. The Efanger bloke is pulling your leg. Oh, okay. Sorry. Bloody Efanger. Just call him E. Easy. Can I call him e uh, Easy? <laughs> oh, we've got seven people in here. Hello. Anybody else in the chat? Feel free to, uh, Say hello. Give me a follow if you don't mind. Yeah, it's a it's a niche little, niche little game, but it brings us all uh, all together, doesn't it? I wish though. I wish TEW was like more like Football Manager. It's just there's not enough community there. We need more people involved in it. Um, I recent I recently did a video a stream on here doing pro wrestling sim. Have any of you played that yet? The pro wrestling sim game. We did it. We did a little test stream um, with, and we booked TNA, and it was all right, but it just wasn't as good as TW. But it was like a, like a, you know what I mean, like a, not as good version, but quicker basically. Yeah, it's just yeah, it's not bad. It's just not as yeah, exactly. Um, yeah, I want it to be, especially because the fact is that they've got a stream workshop, so obviously the community can contribute more there. Um, and I think it's just one of them games that I just don't know whether it will hit 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 it off or not. Um, but the video I posted on YouTube about it is doing quite well, so I might do the odd video on that. I think a bit more. But yeah, uh, Efanger and uh, Matt, we, me, and, me and Josh have been trying to float ideas because we uh, um, last time you were with us, uh, Matt, we were basically doing a WWE. Well, we are currently doing a WWE save. Um, but Dave, who is called the wrestling guy on here, uh, wrestling guy ninety seven, he's just finding it a bit too too much, a bit too daunting. So what we've decided to do is obviously he's still going to be here and contribute when he when he wants to. Um, but we're just now, instead of having three brands, we're going to have two brands and it's going to be me and Josh against each other. So, and then, um, uh, so what we're going to do moving forward from, from next week onwards, um, on a Monday, we're going to be doing the, a, the WWE save still. And then on Tuesday, what we're going to do is we're going to do a local to global one being him. Um, so that might be more your thing. We're going to pick two small level American wrestling promotions or maybe UK, we haven't decided yet. Um, and then basically we're going to try and work, like we'll have the same reputation, the same amount of money, and we're going to try and work our way to the top with that promotion. So uh, it'll be a lot slower because it's obviously going to take us a while to get to get the hang of it uh, on that side of things because um, we've mostly only managed the big, the big wrestling groups. But we're looking forward to it. Um, I think it'll be good. But yeah, I would like you two to become, when you can, obviously I know you're busy and I know the time difference is a bit of a nightmare, but you know, I'd always appreciate you two coming in and just contributing whenever you want. It's much appreciated. Us TEW uh, streamers got to stick together. Yeah, Max, you can be my consultant and Efanga can be Josh's consultant. There you go. We'll work as a team. <laughs> 
Right, Josh, are you ready for me to do the auto brand split on the, the, the remaining people that are left? Because obviously we've got a few uh, AEW wrestlers that we've signed as well, including Ricky Starks. We signed Ricky Starks. Yeah. Can you see the screen on here now? You can see the screen, can't you? On here, um, it says uh, sweep up draft. So the sweep up draft means it just basically drafts all the un the ones that aren't branded. Yeah. So obviously the problem we're going to have that with is, is uh, road agents, uh, announcers and referees are going to be um, on particular brands. But what we'll do is after, after we've done this, we'll just go, oh, no, I don't know what's easier. Hold on. Let me see how many wrestlers we've got that we can possibly. So we've got one, two. Uh, right, let me just count them. So we've got two so far. Three. We haven't got many on here, actually. We've only got four. Uh, I don't mind having Trent Barretta if you want Ricky Starks. Do you want Ricky Starks? I'll have Trent Barretta. And then if you have Brandon... I'll tell you what, if you have Brandon Cutler, I'll let you have Ricky Starks. Uh, no, I'll let you have Aaron Solo. I'll have Brandon, but Brandon Cutler because with Aaron Solo, you could have him in tag matches for Ricky Starks because he used to be a tag team. Oh, yeah, why is it not showing Dave's? Oh, don't, let me have a look. Oh, I don't know. Oh, I know what I've done. Right, I need to... I need to delete Dynasty Brand. There we go. Remove. Right, right, we've only got two brands now, so hopefully... Right, I'll go out of this. Go back into it. Uh... Sweep up. Yeah, there you go. And we'll just go unbranded. Ah, there we go. We're cooking now. Sorry. Cheers, Dave. Are you are you going, Dave? No. Oh, that's all right. I thought you we were saying good luck. I thought that meant you were saying goodbye. <laughs> That's fine. Right then, we ready? I'm gonna do the the sweep up draft, so I can re I'll read them out as we're going along. If you do, if you don't, let me see if you can see them first. So we go do sweep up. Oh, I thought it was gonna do it like one at a time. It's just done them all automatic. Why is this one? Why is these unbranded though? Uh, do sweep up. Oh, I well done then. If I give you Aaron Solo. Oh, I've just given me Aaron Solo. Hold on. I'm not doing well today, am I? Right. Uh... Right, if I give you Aaron Solo, and then go back, unbranded, and if I give you... Where's Ricky Starks gone? Oh, for some reason, Ricky Starks is not on here now. Right, hold on. Let's see where Ricky Starks has gone. Ricky Starks, where are you? Right, Ricky Starks is on Raw. I'm just going to change him over to SmackDown for you. There we go. Right, unbranded workers. I'll have bloody Brandon Cutler. I'll have Roberto Rodriguez as well. And then I'll have... Oh, I've just... What am I doing? Ugh. So, so annoying. I'm sorry, everybody. I'm, I'm just having a brain fart. Right. Where's Trent? There, there we go. Right, let's have a look. I'll show you who you've got on your roster now, Josh, if it lets me. There we go. So we'll go SmackDown, and then we'll go Wrestler. Right, let me just check the chat first so I don't miss anything. Solo sucks bin. I don't want Solo stick him in NXT. Oh, I'll have I'll have Aaron Solo then. I don't mind having Solo. Who have we got from Dynasty then? I'm gonna I'm gonna show you Rostin up. Um right, I'll show you. Alright, I'll just trade him to Oh I've got Aaron Oh no I haven't. I don't know why I keep thinking I'm smacked down all of a sudden. I don't know why. Right. 
So your roster now is Abyss, Ace Austin, AJ Lee. Hold on, let me do male first. If I do male, I'll make it easier. Now we'll do female first because there's less female workers. So you've got AJ, Oscar, Becky Lynch, Bianca Belair, Billy Kay, Candice LeRae, Carmelo, Chelsea Green, Electra Lopez, Indy Hartwell, Eyes the Dawn, Ivy Lee uh, Velez, Ivy Nile, Io Sky, Kairi Zane, Liv Morgan, Mandy Rose, Mayu Iwatani, Nikki James, Natalia, Peyton Royce, Piper Niven, Rhea Ripley, Roxanne Perez, Shayna Baszler, Sonya Deville, Vahala, and Yuka Sakazari. Uh, I won't do that for the male roster because it will take me all day to read them out. So I'll just show you. And then I'll just scroll down in a minute. I'll just let you have a quick read. Yeah, we know you like we know, we know you like stardom, Josh. So it'd be all right. Have you got Gulia? No, you didn't. You didn't have Gulia. Gulia, Julia, whatever her name is. You got Apollo Cruz. Uh, I'm just trying to find the ones that aren't, weren't on your roster originally. Yeah, I'll scroll. I'll scroll down a bit. You got Dominic Mysterio, Finn Balor. Have you got Damien Priest as well? Damien Priest. You've somehow got all the Judgment Day. Other than J... No, you've even got JD as well. You got all that. How the hell did that happen? You've got all the bloody Judgment Day. You git. Ludwig Kaiser. Have you got Giovinci? Giovinci. So you got the Imperium Tag Team. Didn't you already have the Imperium Tag Team? I can't remember. Do you have Gunther? Oh, yeah, I think I think you already had Gunther. Oh, I must have Gunther then. Oh, I've got Gunther. Bonus. You got LA Knight. Uh, Pete Dunn. I assume Tyler Bate. Yeah. Nakamura. Any others? Is there any others there that I haven't seen that you've got? Shinsuke, yeah. Yeah, damn right I've got Gunther. He's going to chop everybody. He'll be, he'll be my champion in the next couple of months, I'll tell you now. Shinsuke, yeah. Was there anybody else on there that you've noticed that you didn't have before? Have I got Chad Gable as well? No, you've got Chad Gable. He's already on your roster, isn't he? Damn, I was hoping I'd have Chad Gable then. Right, let me see what I've got. So we'll go women's. We'll go to women's first. So on the women's side of things, I'm trying to see who I, I think Alba Fire wasn't. Oh no, I already had Alba Fire. Uh, Dakota Kai maybe. Uh, I've got the I've got the the Raver Girls as I like to call them. Uh, Millie McKenzie, that's a good addition. Shotzi. I don't think I had Shotzi before. Tiffany Stratton. Get in. Woo woo. Right. Let's have a look at the male roster. Let's see what I've got on the male side of things. Uh, Bron Breaker. Oh, yeah. I've got Bron Breaker. I've got Brutus Creed. I've got Julius Creed. I bet I have the Julius Creed. Oh, for God's sake, you've got Julius Creed. You've got the better brother of the two. Can we do a can we do a swap? Can we do like a thing where I have the other? The, no, no, I don't know. Actually, I know you. You'll probably want somebody. I want. I don't want to lose. Uh, I got Carlito, which I didn't have before. I got Charlie Dempsey as well. Chris, no, I had Chris Brooks already. Uh, Dragon Lee, I think I had Dragon Lee before. Oh, have I got? Have I got Kit? Oh, I've got I've got both of them. That's good. I've got the the most charismatic tag team in the world. I've got Epico and Carlito as well. Gunther, Eric. Have I got Ivar? I've got Ivar. I've got the Viking Raiders. My tag division's just bolstered up massively now. Um, Jack Evans. Not too bothered about him. Joe Gacy. Not too bothered about him. Kurt Angle. Suppose he's all right. Lince Dorado. I probably got the other. I've got the other Lucha House Party then. Uh, oh, I've got a trick. Do I need to send him to developmental anyway? 
Who's got Carmella Hayes? Have you got him? Carmella Hayes? No, you must have him. Who else have I got moving forward? Von Wagner. I've got the great man. I've got Tucker. I can have Tucker and Otis as a tag team now. Tony Nese, the most boring man ever. Santos Escobar, get in. I've got Rick Boobs. <laughs> oh, I'm pushing him. Rick Boobs. I've got Primo. Uh, Matt Riddle. So I've got Matt Riddle as well. Oh, I feel I feel happier already. I feel like I won that one. Yeah, take Julius. You don't want Julius. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. So do you want me to have Julius then? Is that what you're saying for 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 free? You don't want to do it. You don't want to do a little swappy swap. Can I just take him off you? That's very kind of you. Right, let's do that. Julius. Come to me, Julius. Right, okay. So now let's go. You want to have a look at your roster and you want to tell me who you want to send. So we'll do that. We'll do... Oliver. So there's your roster. So just... I appreciate you letting me have uh, Julius. Ifanga, uh Matt, who do you think had the better the 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 better the better brand split there? Who do you think got the better wrestlers? Do you think do you think I've improved Raw or do you think SmackDown is more improved? You can have Abyss. Oh man, I love Abyss. I'll happily have him off you. Happy days. Oh Dave, I don't like you no more. I've got Gunther. And Bron Breaker. Yeah, I got Gunther and Bron Breaker. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that trumps any of them. <laughs> did he have the New Day as well? Did he get the New Day as well? I think he did, didn't he? He's got Biggie. Oh, no, he already had the New Day, didn't he? I think you already had the New Day. Yeah, you already had the New Day, didn't you? No, you didn't. He's got the New Day as well, hasn't he? Has he had Xavier? Yeah. He's had the new day as well. Yeah, you're probably right. He probably is overall done better than me. I feel I'm happy though. I'm happy though. I'm quite happy with my my uh, additions though. Right, you can have a bit. Yeah, I've already took him off you. I just need to. Oh yeah, I'll search it again. There you go. He's gone. Just tell me if you want. Just tell me who you want me to send to NXT if there's anybody or if you don't mind me. If I particularly want him off you, you don't want Batista. Should we just bin Batista? I'm gonna get. I'm gonna release Batista. No, actually, I won't release him because his popularity is really good. I'm gonna send him. To, can I? Can I have your permission to send him to Raw? Oh, okay, that's cool. Right. Okay, I will have him on Raw, and he can. Him and Goldberg could be a tag team. Right. I'll search it again so it gets rid of him. There you go. I've updated it. You can have a look now. Chris Hero bin. Oh, I'm having Chris Hero definitely. I'll never, I'll never book him, but I just want him because he's just, I just, I just love him as a, uh, as a wrestler in real life. So I'll happily take him up here. Yeah. I'll have all your, uh, the ones that you don't like. I don't mind. Yeah, just let me know if you want me to scroll down. If there's anybody else you want me to send. Right, just bear with us two seconds, just sending a message to someone. Right, I'm back on. Uh, scroll down, yet? Yeah. okay, sorry. Let me scroll down. How is uh, how is Matt and Ifanga today? Any exciting plans for the weekend for you both?
Mad Cat Moss. I don't know if I want Mad Cat Moss. No, I'll send him to NXT. I don't think I'll ever use him, so I'll send him off on his way. Right, if I just do that, there you go, so you can see a bit more. Mansoor, Bin, okay. Right, if I scroll down all the way down to here now, you probably can see the other ones. RVD. I'm having RVD then if you don't want him. He's the whole effing show. Rough and damn. Do, 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 the whole effing show. He has had, he has had good, some, some good... Uh, I'm having Mickey James. Bloody hell. You don't know talent, do you? Mickey James. You having a laugh, mate? Anyone else? Want to throw me? No. No, I don't. I know you're giving me loads, but no. <laughs> nice try, though. Tyler Breeze, Ben. Okay. I don't particularly want Tyler Breeze either. Uh, okay, send him away. Mayu, NXT. Where is Mayu? Oh, there she is. You don't want Mayu as one? Oh, yeah. Popularity is not very good, is it? Yeah, no worries. That's it. Okay. Cool. So, I need to end some of these Dynasty storylines. So, end that one. Do you want to keep? Do you want to keep the new day Judgment Day storyline, Josh? It is it is doing very well. Uh, the storyline is considered hot, so I've got Viking Raiders, Josh. So would you want me to end it then? Okay. Do you want to keep? I oh, know you said you want to get rid of them. I'll just get rid of all of them. Don't matter. Raw, 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 raw. Smack this, smack this, smack this. All right. Yeah, if I show you, I think I've got Ivar and, and that. Uh, Raw. Yeah, I've got Eric and Ivar. They're already in a stable anyway. Uh, Eric and Ivar's already in a, in a stable with Killian Dane and Seamus, I think. Uh, yeah, if you don't mind, I will take Vahala because she can just manage them. Much appreciated. She'll never wrestle, but she is a good manager. Right. Right. We are... The next show is yours in three days and then four days, and we've done an hour so far. Right, that's fine. Let me just continue then to the next show. Your next show is your SmackDown. Yeah, I deleted them. I deleted them when you were in that meeting. So, yeah, yeah, done it. And I got rid of the, the events that Dynasty had as well. So, yeah. Dave, are you happy with the uh, where, where the, re the wrestlers that you had have gone? I bet you probably wish that Dave had them all. Uh yeah, you can have the you can have the women's tag team titles. You've probably got more women's tag teams than I have anyway, ain't you? So yeah, I don't mind that. Jumpers back, fully fit. Um right, just need to change the titles to so women's tag team titles. Uh edit, and then we just do Brand SmackDown. I want to change the photo for some reason. It's not. It's not giving us. Ah, there we go. Women's tag team. That's not the. Oh, it is. There we go. Right. Exclusive to SmackDown now. 
Cheers, Dave. At least it takes. At least you can probably just sit back and enjoy it instead of stressing out about booking it now. Uh, right. Let me forward another day. Right, let me check let me check my Twitch for two seconds. I just want to see if it says I can be monetized now. Because I want to make money. <laughs> oh for God's sake, it's still saying I've only got 49, which ain't true. I've got 51 now. So I don't understand. Maybe it just takes a while to update. Maybe by tomorrow it'll be updated. Right, anyway. Has everyone followed Dave? Not Dave. Oh, Lucha. Yeah, the ones that are in here at the moment, uh, Matt, uh, Matt and Ifanga have followed me. I've followed them back as well. Uh, has Dave followed me? Have I followed Dave? I think I followed Dave as well, yeah. But yeah, thank you all of you in the chat. Uh, it's nice that we're building a little bit of uh, community. Oh, Josh, can you see what I've just seen on the news, on the thing? I don't think I'd follow you. I'll follow you now, Josh. I forgot to follow you. Sorry, mate. Um, Ayo Scott, Ayo Shirai is pregnant. So does that mean you? You can't obviously have her now. She's she's she starts maternity leave in one month. Oh, I thought you meant she, her maternity leaves only one month. I don't know. So you won't be able to put her in any wrestling matches, will you? I mean, if you do, that's very irresponsible of you. Do you, want me to just, do you want me to vacate the title? Because you can't put her in a match, so drop those titles. Ayoska is the, the... She's not the tag champion. That's Asuka and Kari. You're going you're gonna to risk her pregnancy, you horrible bastard. You horrible... You're going to put her in that situation. Oh, God have mercy on your soul, young man. Right, Jimmy Uso, Wade Barrett, Nakamura, and um, as Reese as sign new contracts, and we've also got Dustin Rhodes. So we'll leave Dustin Rhodes unbranded at the moment, and then if we get a couple, we can just uh, so Dustin Rhodes can wrestle for both. I'm going to change him to Gold Dust though. If that's all right with you. Do we think that we should kick Josh out of the stream for willing to have Io Sky, who's pregnant? Uh, wrestle. I feel like that's a that's a booting out offence, don't you, everyone? Actually, no. I don't want to boot him out because I'd be lost without Josh on here. So uh, I have to make that exception. Right. Change him to Goldust nineties. No, Goldust. Should we do the, the artist for me? No, no. No, we'll just do Goldust. Right. Load alter ego. There you go. So I think we should be able to have. Cody and Goldust as a tag team now, I think. I think I should. Where is it? Oh, they're not on here for some reason. Right, Cody, Goldust. Let's see if they are. Uh... Oh, they are. They are on there. Right, add. What? Hold on. There's two workers already in there. Oh, they're already on here. Sorry. Uh... Is that one? No. Bear with us, everyone. There you go. I'm gonna I'm gonna resurrect free MB. The Dust Brothers, that's a terrible name. We're gonna call them the Rhodes Dynasty. There you go, the Rhodes Dynasty, a little tribute to Dave there. We're gonna reunite Golden Truth as well for my sense of humour. Uh, for some reason, we didn't have the OC as a unit. Right. There you go. Uh, let me just check if there's anything else we've missed. Right, that's that. So, let's just check if there's any tag teams we need to add. Uh, country dominance, no, no. Ah, there we go. Uh, 
Uh, I think that's it. There's no more. Chris Brooks and we'll throw him in there as an occasional tag team, I suppose. Right. Let's just reset that. There we go. Right. Sorry. Let me check the chat now. Sorry, bro. I get I get distracted. Kim. Yeah, I know. I know. Josh, disgraceful. Right. Let's skip to SmackDown now. Right then, Josh. A whole new era, era for SmackDown. Right, let me know bit by bit what you want to do. Do you want to look at your roster again before you... Just let me know if you want to look at your roster. Or anything like that. Ifanga, uh, Matt, are you looking forward to WrestleMania? I know Ifanga said... He doesn't. He hasn't watched it much over the years, so uh, it's more. This question's more for you, Matt. Are you looking forward to WrestleMania this year? I'm gonna have a rare break, hydration break, while I wait for Josh. Josh, just let me know bit by bit what you want me to do. Do you want any any new storylines added? Always looking forward to the big four. Some of the ones in between, I don't care for as much. Yeah, that's true. There's some matches I'm really looking forward to, similar to you, and then there's others I'm not too bothered about. Right, Rock, Roman, Seth, all on mic. Right. Oh no, Seth Rollins. Done. D I Y B A T R K. Danny Gungano and Tommaso. Open match. Uh, Matt, Ifanga, you know when you play TEW, you know when you're booking a match, do you add anything in the road agent notes or do you just keep it simple like we do? Uh, just let us know. Oh, God, you've only got two commentators. What's going on here? Uh, can't do anything about announcers at the moment. Hold on. Uh... Why have we only got... I need to change the announcers after this. I'll just have to leave it as Mora and Jim Ross, I think. There's nobody else that's good enough. William Regal? No, I better leave it. Right, I just need to change this. Jim Ross, Moro. Uh, can I change announcers? No, I can't. Uh, let me see if I can do it on here. Announcers. Ah, there we go. Uh, right, I just need to... So we'll just do him. There's none. So you can do everything. Uh, oh, wrong one. What am I doing? Uh... 
Hold on, bear with us, everyone. Sorry. Right. Announcer. Uh, just get rid of that. Uh, Jim Ross. Change you to none. Kevin Kelly. Change you. Moro. Change you. Michael Carl, we've already changed. Right, let's go. Uh, Colour. Corey, we'll change you to none as well. Maurice, change you to none, even though you're not going to be used as a commentator at any point. Same as you, Pat McAfee. Uh, Paul Heyman. I oh, know Paul Haynes is exclusive to Raw. You know, having a Trent Barrett can apparently be a, a co commentator. There you go. Uh, I know we'll leave. You, we'll let you have him. All right, right. So we should now, in theory. Right when we book you next thing, we'll see. Sorry, sorry about that, everyone. Right, what's your next bit, Josh? I just wanted to make sure that you had decent announcers. Oh, actually, I've, while you're while I'm waiting, I'll just quickly change these two. So you got Corey in there as well. Corey. Corey. Right, I need to keep an eye on that. No, that's all right, mate. I just don't want you to get a bad rating on your show. I mean, I do, but not like, not really. Yeah, I've just updated. Oh no, I haven't. Yeah. Uh, announcers so events is the it's fine raw is okay smackdown you've still got the same as you had before raw tv same same yeah so should be in theory so you had you had michael cole and jim ross didn't you and corey Graves. so we just we need to just change michael Cole there, Michael Cole on this one, oh, there we go, right, let me check the chat, Rhea and Shayna beat Lynch and Liv Morgan, Angle, Judgment Day, Finn on Mike. You want Rhea Ripley in this one now as well, because you have got technically Rhea Ripley in. I know she's not in Judgment Day anymore. We got rid of her out the stable, so it don't make sense, does it? Finn Balor, Microphone, Damien Priest, Dominic, JD. Right, next. Uh, thank you, Dave, Efanger, and Matt for staying in the stream. Uh, I appreciate you still being here. Did you make note of my last show, by the way, Josh, on on your little uh, little thingamajig? Just curious, because you're booking this show now, so. I just want to make sure I, we know what, what result I had on mine. I think I had 91 or something. Or was it 80? It was either 83 or 91. I can't remember. I'll go back on Instagram while I'm waiting for you to, to figure out what you're doing. Uh, you've only done 60 minutes so far. You've got another 60 minutes to go yet. So just take your time. There's no rush. Oh, sorry. Right. Judgment Day. B 
Keep the good brothers. Is that Damien Priest and Finn? I assume it is. I'll always assume it is, but if it isn't, just tell me if it's any different. Right, that's that done. Right, what's your next bit? Right, next. Any exciting plans for the weekend, Dave? Any exciting plans with the twins? Drew Cody both on my... Going to London Zoo. Ah, oh, fair play. Yeah, I want to go to London Zoo. I've not been. Have you been to London Zoo before? Is it any good? Yeah, hopefully the weather's good. Uh, the puppy is fine. The puppy mostly sleeps and shits and pees everywhere. Um, but he's getting better. Um, but yeah, thank you for asking. Uh, I got a good night's sleep last two nights we've had him. He literally, now, he'll go... He'll go into his bed straight away and go straight to sleep. He won't even try and get onto the bed with us. He knows not to go on the bed. So he's trained himself up. He knows how to run up the stairs, by the way. But then he hasn't got the confidence to go down the stairs. So he'll just stand at the top of the stairs and bloody whinge at me until I go and get him. He's, an, he's, a, little, he's a little diva already, I tell you. Yeah, hopefully the weather will be good for you, though. Right, you've done 89 minutes, so you've got uh, half an hour left, Josh. Apparently, in nine days, the sun will be set at 19.32. So we're supposed to be having some, some nice sun in nine days' time. Dave, at any point, if Josh is ill and he can't do a, can't do a stream, you can, you can take over the booking of his, of his brand. I think that should be the rule. So you can occasionally be a substitute teacher. <laughs> right, has he said anything? Oh, there we go. Right, Cody and Jay beat Drew and Seamus. Oh, no, what have I done? Oh, hold on, I pressed the wrong thing. Hold on, let me go back to the booking screen. Your first thing got a 95 rating. Sorry about that. Right. I don't know what the hell I did there then. Eh. Right. Cody. J. Sorry about that, Josh. Drew. James. Angle, J, Roman, Cody, Drew, my, oh, I said J. Okay. Is this an angle for before the match or after the match? You want it before the match? Can you add AJ Styles rated on the mic to the judgment? Yeah, okay. Uh, 
the day. Before, okay. Right, you've got 123 minutes booked. Do you want to add anything or just crack on with it now? Kevin Owens beats middle of the card, okay. I think, I think, uh, yeah, because Apollo Crews is Intercontinental Champion. So I put him on SmackDown now. So the Intercontinental title is exclusive to SmackDown. Uh, and you've also got the women's tag team. You've got all the titles now. I don't mind having less titles, though. It doesn't bother me. I can just add another title at some point. I could have the hardcore title, for instance, if I really wanted to. Uh, right. Kevin Owens, Apollo Crews. Do you want the, do you want this for the Intercontinental title? Do you want me to have the United States title off you then? Yeah, okay. Right, so you want this for the Intercontinental title, yeah? So Kevin Owens to win the Intercontinental title. Right, so I need to, first of all, United States Championship before I forget. So, I think in theory I should have Chad Gable now then if he's the champion. No, he's joking, don't worry. Right, so we edit that. Oh, Raw. And then, where is it? United States Champion, I need to vacate the title. Hold on, let me ch check the chat first. Oh, hold on. Wait, 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 hold on. Now, Chad can retire US title and then I'll do... So you don't mind me vacating the United States champion then, yeah? Just want to know before I do it. I literally was just about to do it then. So I can vacate the... Yeah, okay, that's all right, mate. I thought I'd nearly balls up then. Right, so that's that done. Right, so... Oh, I need to move that. I don't want that to be your main event, do I? For God's sake. I'm pressing down every time, but for some reason it goes up every so often. Right, are you happy with that? With that how it is now, yeah? Do you want me to press continue? Yeah, you right for me to carry on? Yeah, cool. Right, your first angle got 95 rating, by the way, just in case you didn't know. Um, when I ball stuff. The... Triple tag team match uh, got a 86 right here. Uh, the other tag match got a 91 right in. The angle with the New Day and AJ got a 90 right in. Bloody hell, 97 for the Intercontinental title match. 95, Jesus Christ, you're going to beat me this week easily. 95 for the tag team title match. Oh, no. No, was it tag team title? Just tag team match, sorry. Uh, the angle, yeah, you're definitely, definitely beating me. I'll be amazed if you don't beat me. Jesus Christ, 100. And then the match got a 90. I, I reckon, I, if, I, if you don't get a 95 from this show, I'll be amazed. It's got to be at least 95, I reckon. Right, let's click on this. Oh, 93. Did I get a 93? No, I didn't get... 94? What are you on about 94? This is 93. Oh. Oh, that was your prediction, wasn't it? Yeah. Why did you get a 90... Why did you only get a 93? You had 90s and everything. Oh, 86, that one. It might have been that tag match, maybe. I suppose, because ABC aren't very over-popularity-wise, over, over and neither was A-Town Down Under, I don't think, so that might have been the only thing. If you did not have that tag match... Or and then maybe did a different match with more popular people, you'd have probably got a better rating. But I mean, you still did amazing. I think you beat me, didn't you? Did I only get a ninety-one? What did I get last time? Uh, what did I get on my Raw show? Can you remember? Ninety-one. 
91, yeah. So you, did, you beat me. So that's all that matters at the end of the day, doesn't it? But yeah, it is a bit harsh. I thought you'd have, I, I thought you'd have got a higher score than that for that one. So do you want to start the head to head again? So we'll just say this is week one of the the head to head between you and me, and then, uh, but just if I do the raw show, oh, all right, mate, no worries, Dave. Cheers for coming along. Have a nice weekend. I'll be back on a Monday, two p.m. UK time. Enjoy enjoy your time at the zoo. At the zoo, not with the zoo. At the zoo. Yeah. So if we start that as week one of the head to head, then Josh, uh, Ju so has signed a new contract. Pete Dunn signed a new contract, and more importantly, Brian Danielson's coming back to WWE. Everyone, we brought him back. Oh my God, I'm salivating. Well, that Brian Danielson not exclusive to any brands. Who the hell's Cornelius Crumbles? Who the hell's he? Oh, God knows. Okay. Uh, Becky Lynch opinion. Grayson Waller talks well. So, more promo time for Grayson Waller. Uh, JD McDonough is a natural talker. So, more promo time for him. Uh, and then Finn Balor's also said Grayson Waller talks well. So, a lot of people supporting Grayson Waller on the mic, mate. Yeah, Cornelius, whatever it was, Cornelius. What, you want Cornelius? No, I know, I know, I know who you're on about. I'm only joking. Brian Danielson is going is not going to be exclusive to anybody. Any wrestlers that we sign now from AEW, uh, we'll just leave them as non brand exclusive. Uh Jim Ross said happy, so I'm just going to give him a little Brucey bonus. No. Is that no, you don't want Cornelius, or have I done something terrible? Have I done something wrong? Real question is, do we call Brian Danielson Daniel Bryan, or do we leave him as Brian, as Brian Danielson? What do you reckon? He needs to change a photo because that's a very old photo of him. That's better. Even though it's AEW background, but Daniel Bryan. I hope he never retires on this game because it'll be really annoying if he does. Uh, but I'm really, really buzzing that we've managed to sign. One of my favourite wrestlers of all time, by the way, Daniel Bryan. Um, but yeah. I'm going to have Daniel Bryan and Gunther wrestle and I'm going to have Bryan Danielson, uh, Daniel Bryan, John Cena, Daniel Bryan, CM Punk, uh, Daniel Bryan, Bron Breaker. We should do a separate head to head to see who can get the best match with Daniel Bryan. Who can get the best match rating week to week? How about that? Should we try that? Should we just wrestle him until the ground until he actually retires from injuries? Uh, right. I've got my show. I've got my backlash show coming up now. Backstage. Right, let me just check the chat. Oh no, I thought there was uh, something added there. Right. Uh, we're going to go Daniel Bryan. Why the hell is Daniel Bryan not on here? Oh, he can't. He can't wrestle yet. I think he's still under contract with AEW. I don't think he's officially signed yet. He's got to tie up his. Oh, that's a shame. Oh, I can have Daniel Bryan versus Okada. Ah. Oh. Uh, CM Punk 
I need him in the main event, so I'll leave him for now. Right, Bobby Lashley. Bobby Lashley versus Andrade. Um, most I'm probably going to just have these. Uh, we'll have Andrade win. Open match. Decisive win. Slow build. Uh, allow high risk moves. Allow high input, spinal. Uh, and then end storyline. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There we go. End storyline. Right, so that storyline will be ended with this match. Uh, we'll do... And then we'll do Samu and Alpha. Uh, uh, I'll have... Malcolm and Razor win. Open match. Decisive win. Uh, allow spinal moves. Allow that. End storyline. Right. There we go. Right, let me just check the chat so I'm not missing anything. I've started my TEW. Oh, okay. Who have you decided to be on your diary then? Is it is it New Japan still or is it TNA? I can't remember who you decided on though. Right, Raw. Bailey versus Alexa now. So do that. Actually, I'm going to do a four way. Four way women's match and that, and then we'll go half an hour. Uh, shall I do something different? There you go. Sod it, mix it up a bit. Four way TLC match. Uh, Charlotte. Uh, end storyline, right. If my mic suddenly goes off, it's because the dog's messing around. And my mic is very sensitive. Right. It's okay, he hasn't moved. Not sure you will like it though. Oh no, no. Uh, maybe Matt or Ifanga, they might like the C-verse. Do does Matt and Ifanga, do you like the C-verse? I only like real people, but Josh is quite into the C-verse, which is fair enough. Like I said, I don't judge him for it. It's just not really my cup of tea. Uh, right, storylines. CM Punk. I forgot CM Punk and Randy Orton in a storyline. Hold on, my dog's playing up. I think he needs to go to the toilet. Hold on. Come on, then. There you go. You go do what you need to do. Right, let me just check something. Hello. Yeah, you can still hear me. It's okay. Right. Uh, and then Angel versus 
Montez and Angelo, Daw Angelo Dawkins. No, 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 no. Right, that's that. Uh, open match. Slow build. Decisive win. Allow high risk moves. Allow him there, and then we won't put. We won't. We'll advance this story. Oh, I don't need to do that. We'll keep this storyline going because I haven't really done much much of them. All right, let me just check the chat. Yeah, we do. We do have massive rosters now, especially now. Dave's left. We, Dynasty's gone. We have got a bloody even bigger roster now, and we keep raiding AEW. I was really hoping Daniel Bryan was. I was hoping to give him his re debut in WWE. I wanted to trump you. But I think you'll end up you'll end up probably booking him before I do now. Come on then, quick, quick, quick! Don't, don't, not, don't move my knock, don't move my. Oh no, I think you've just moved it. I think you've just knocked it. Here, you are. right, you stay there. Hold on, let me just check. Hello, yeah, it's alright. Sorry, right. Oh. But oh, microphone. Uh, right, what other storylines have I got? I've got Randy Orton and CM Punk. I think that's it. Right, so how much have we got left? We've done two hours, we just need to do an hour more. So we'll just do four way single, I think. Uh, Sami Zayn, Gunther, ho oh, oh, ho oh, ho, Gunther, uh, right, I got way too excited about Gunther then, didn't I, sorry, right, hold on, let's get rid of unimportant, let's get rid of that, Okada, uh, Rey Mysterio. Look at that for a four way match. Four way dream match, that is. And rightly so, Gunther wins. Sami Zayn's not happy. I don't care, Sami Zayn. You're losing to Gunther. Okada's not... Oh, okay. I'm going to have to... Right, we'll just get rid of him and we'll just figure out who's going to win. Yeah, that's fine. Right. Uh, Why have we got that? Come on. Booking analysis? Dan Eagles has filed too much... Uh, I just need to change the ref on this one. Yeah, right. Uh right, just one more match, one more angle, and then the main event, and then I'll be ready to go. Sorry it's taking so long, everybody. Right, main event. I need a I want a big match, big singles match for this one. I wanna what are we going with? Cage. Uh, 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 dog collar. There you go. Right, I'm ready to go. Let me just check the chat. Right, I'm ready to go now. So, the first match, Andrade defeated Bobby Lashley. Got an 84 rating. 
the uh, the tag match that ended the storyline got a eighty rating. AOP retained their tag team champions. Chip, sorry. Uh, four way TLC match got a fifty three rating, which is understandable because it was a specialty match. So I was expecting it. I'm willing to take chances. I don't mind. Ronda Rousey won. Uh, Los Leferios defeated the Street Profits. Got an 81 rating. I swear I had that as slow build. Oh, well. Right. Uh, Sami Zayn defeated Gunther, Okada and Rey Mysterio. Retains his title. And then the angle got an 82. And the match only got 71 again because I took a chance and did a uh, specialty match. But it is what it is. Right. I got 76 ratings, so you'll definitely beat me, Josh. Oh, yeah. I keep forgetting slow build. Yeah, I know. Oh, well. It don't matter, Josh. It don't matter. It's all about having fun. I'd rather have fun booking crazy matches. I don't need to win all the time. It's it's only a game. I won't cry into my pillow tonight, I promise. Right, I don't think I'm going to do much more now. I think I'm just going to process another day or two to, to the next show and save it as that because we're nearly coming up to two hours now. So I'll just have a look at this. Rey Mysterio Sr. is retired. Jake Roberts retired. Charlotte Flair says that Akum is charismatic. Randy Orton says that Samu uh, Alofa doesn't connect with the fans. So I'm going to get rid of um, Samu. Is it Samu he said? Oh, no, I'll leave it because it will upset the bloodline. I don't want to upset them. I'll just leave it. Right. Uh... Right, we've got SmackDown, we've got Raw. So i just forward this. Um, but yeah, I'm going to save this in a second. But thank you to Josh. Thank you to Dave. I know he's not here, but thank you anyway. Uh, thank you to Matt and Ifanga for joining in as well. Uh, hope I hope that you've enjoyed it. Um, I'll be back on Monday with either the WWE save or... Depending on what me and Josh decide to do, we might do the the new head uh, local to global head to head starting Monday. Um, but we'll I'll, I'll have a think and then speak to Josh about it. So yeah, but thank you everyone. I'm gonna call it a day. Josh, enjoy your weekend, buddy. I'll message you tomorrow or all tonight later on, um, depending on what I'm doing. But yeah, thank you as always. Enjoy the rest of your weekend, everyone. Uh, I'll be back on Monday. See you later. Bye.